In problem number 28 of Appendix A, we're going to prove a claim that I actually made in the, uh, in the solution video to problem number 27. And in that video, I said that um, the unit tangent vector and the unit normal uh, vector were actually perpendicular. Um, and that's exactly what this uh, problem asks us to prove. Uh, we want to show that uh, the dot product of the unit uh, tangent and the unit normal vectors are equal to zero. And we'll start off by actually looking at the dot product of the unit tangent vector. Um, just to simplify notation, I'm just going to write t without the small t there. And well, this is um, equal to the magnitude of t uh, times the magnitude of t times uh, cosine of the angle. Uh, in between them. Well, we're looking at the same vector here, and we know that um, it's a unit vector. In other words, its length is 1. So this just is actually equal to well, just the um, cosine of the angle between them, which is 0. So cosine of 0 is 1. Uh, now we can take the derivative of both sides with respect to time. And on the right side, we're taking the derivative of a constant, so we just have 0. And on the left side, we'll need to use the product rule. So we have the derivative of uh, t with respect to time uh, times uh, t, or excuse me, dot product t, plus uh, unit tangent uh, dot product with the derivative of the unit tangent. And we now know that that's equal to 0. And I'm going to continue this up over here. Now, the dot product is commutative, meaning that we can rearrange uh, the terms. So we know that these are actually equal. So dt with respect to time uh, times uh, unit tangent and have this times 2, since these are, like I said, both equal. Uh, this will be equal to 0. So now we know that um, this is equivalent to saying t prime of t dot, if we divide both sides by 2, we can just write t prime of t uh, dot with uh, the unit tangent vector is equal to 0. But now let's take a look at the definition of uh, the unit normal vector. We have unit normal vector is the derivative of the unit tangent over the magnitude of the unit tangent, or magnitude of the derivative, rather, of the unit tangent vector. So if we put this all together and um, just compute uh, the quantity t dot n, we see that this is equal to well, t uh, dot t prime of t over the magnitude of t prime of t. But this is just a constant here in the denominator, so this factors out. And we just proved up here that um, t prime of t dotted with t of t is actually equal to 0. So this part here is just 0. So we see that uh, the dot product of the unit normal and the unit tangent is indeed equal to 0. So those two vectors are, are in fact perpendicular.